Hi guys, Belinda here. Welcome back. Today I'm working on a, a 12 by 24 inch canvas. And um, so I've been trying to make a decision on what colors to go down with. So and I've had a, a quite a, a paint issue this morning. I think that, or even yesterday, I think the paint gods are definitely not with me. So, you know, sometimes these things happen. And hopefully, I'll have a good outcome. So, what I've made up here is pink. I'm going to just run through my colors very quickly. So, I have white. Now, my white, titanium white, is a mixture of Liquitex Basics and uh, Derivin, Matisse Derivin. You can get 20% discount off on this. You just check out uh, in the description. I'll leave the code there in the link. And um, then I'm using the pink, the Liquitex Basics, uh, magenta, medium magenta. And then I have a bright pink here, which is Atelier Brilliant Magenta. So I have a, a light blue here as well, as well as I've made up a grey. So this is actually, I've got some Mars Black Titanium White and I've put some silver in there just to, to lift it a little bit. So my colors that I've got, I've got a couple of different pinks here and uh, that's the magenta. So the pouring medium I'm using is the Floetrol and I'll leave the description, in the description, the um, how you actually make up your paint. Quite a couple of people have said to me, but how are you getting the soles without Floetrol? Oh, sorry, without silicone. Well, that's it, you know, it's with the Floetrol. And it's how you actually mix your paints. So, um, seems as the paint guards are not with me. <laughs> and I'm a little bit unsure of where I'm going with this. I'm going to lay down my paint. So I'll be doing the pink here and then the titanium white up there. And I'll see you back here in a minute. Right guys, so I've laid down my colors, my base coat. And I think, um, trying to decide which colors to go with first. I know the grey is just going to kind of be on the background. Okay, let's go with the grey first. And then, I think I might go with... the darker pink so that will always, the first colors down are going to be your outer colors and then I'm going to go in with this beautiful blue so my top color will be the pink, the bright pink Oh, those colors are gorgeous. I'm loving that. Now I'm going in with this brighter pink. And I think, I'm just thinking, I wonder if I should just put some more blue on top of that. 
because I love the that color combination is looking really really nice I don't know guys hmm do I leave it like that or do I add more blue because the blue is then going to be the top color or well, let's add a little bit if it comes out today <laughs> Okay, and then I'll give that a torch. So I don't know if you can see, but that silver that I added to the grey is really shining up beautifully. So I'm actually pleased that I added that silver in. Right. Okay, <laughs> I dragged the, the hair dryer through that, but that's okay, just touch it up a bit, so now I'm going to be using my world's smallest blower. I would like to get these up here a bit. I'm just looking at the composition guys I yeah I love it I think that uh, these cells and everything are just divine just give it another torch and then I'll bring you in for a close-up all right guys this is it absolutely love these colors I think they actually turned out pretty well what do you guys think of the color combination um, the cells are just absolutely gorgeous and excuse the studio light guys it's very dark it's winter so I'm trying to Hidden as much as I can without the the glow from the light. Sorry about that. And I absolutely love, love, love this part here. Hopefully I can get in some of that silver shimmer. Hi 
right guys so thanks again for watching and i hope you enjoyed this and i'll see you in the next one thanks guys bye